and as far as government goes, to the right of Attila the Hun. But socially, I'm as, con as open as you can get. I'm as liberal as you can get. I, I really think that God means, God made us all. I do believe in God. God made us all for what we are and the way we came out. I mean, I don't think that he's pointed every little detail. I think he took a bunch of sand and threw it out there and said, grow babies, you know, any way you can. But you know that I couldn't care less about what, what persuasion you are sexually, what persuasion you are in color, what persuasion you are in religion. God made us all, and we must all cherish and respect each other. We don't have to necessarily love each other, but let's respect each other. Where, Rudy, because you know you and I, you know, are super cool. I love you to mm -hmm. death. Mm -hmm. But do you think that there is still that underlining um, layer of racism that still affects us as a society in the way we think? I I would have totally agreed with that concept maybe 10 or 15 years ago. I don't agree with it anymore. I think that our police officers and everybody who is in the line of public service gets such training on that now. And when you take a look at, at what we have in the, in the mix of our public servants, uh, it's very heavily black now. So I think that it's changing as well it should. And I think it has changed to some degree. And of course, it still has further to go. I'm not in that area. I'm not any kind of an expert in any way. All I know is what I see in the press. And it seems to me that the press now covers it very fast and furiously if it's a black person. Why do you think he's a communist? I, I don't think he's a communist, but I think he is of that persuasion. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, you are what you are brought up to be until you are old enough to get out there and discover the world is a lot bigger and a lot lovelier than your mother and father necessarily told you about. Mm -hmm. So I, I love what we're going through in the United States, and I think we're going through it very fast. When you stop and think that where we were 200 years ago, and slavery is something that's been with us since the inception of mankind. So what are we talking about? What happened in the United States?